The most fascinating thing about hero shooters to me is that a big chunk of them flop badly. Bleeding Edge, Lawbreakers, Crucible, Battleborn, Battle for Neighborville. You have a few of them that are kinda minding their own business. Think of Garden Warfare, Valorant and Apex Legends. But the consensus between people is that there are two kings at the top of the pile. Overwatch and Black Ops 4 baby. Hell yeah. No, of course it's Team Fortress 2. Of course it is. Now, I don't think this comes over as a surprise to anyone, but I freaking adore TF2, even still with all of its current problems, hashtag save TF2. It is without a doubt the most fun you can have online out of any multiplayer shooter. This game is perfection. Then you have Overwatch. I don't really like Overwatch, this game to me at least is genuinely irritating to play and I'm not just trying to say TF2 good, Overwatch bad. Because this title can be genuinely really fun at times but to get to those fun parts you have to sit through some annoying BS like god awful balancing, fighting against provoking heroes, reading the general chat which is the equivalent to sitting in a daycare filled with little babies. Overwatch gameplay loop is so sensitive around team play which is fine honestly there are a lot of games that do this well but the moment one person of your team steps out of line it crumbles instantly and your experience turns into this sour distasteful bleh. I think my biggest gripe with Overwatch though is how annoying the abilities are to fight okay. against. Things like Doomfist, Uppercut, Roadhog's Hook, Maze Blizzard, McCree's Flashbang. They are fun to use okay but fighting against them is stupid and they feel extremely cheap every single time. The enemy needs to press a button and you die. You can pull the positioning card and say it's your own fault for not being in the right place at the right time, which it is, but that doesn't change the fact that it is annoying. Getting insta-killed, stunned or frozen because the enemy pressed a button is stupid. Stupid. Not every single ability is annoying, but a big chunk of them are. And this whole game is built upon these stupid abilities. It's frustrating. I've yet to meet one person in my life that has played Overwatch without doing this. It also doesn't help that Overwatch has this continuous push of trying to be a competitive shooter. I'm all for a game having a competitive side to it, but I also think it's important to differentiate competitive from casual. Now personally, I'm not a competitive guy at all. I like to play games for fun and to experience new adventures, so when every game is a sweat fest, it just gets annoying. You have to start introducing things like skill-based matchmaking and... Oh my, roll cute. Seriously, this system is it's so fucking convoluted. I just want to play a game of Overwatch, man. I don't I don't want to wait eight minutes doing nothing. Thankfully, okay, Blizzard, the most respected and welcoming company in the world, noticed that Overwatch has so many glaring issues that they decided to throw it into a ditch and slap a two next to it. Now, um, I, I didn't get into the beta of this because, uh, frankly, XD. I didn't really care. But uh, here's what they did, all right. They turned it into a 5v5 instead of a 6v6. They made the tanks more tanky. They gave everything this dipshit glare for no reason. And they changed McCree's name to Cowboy Paul. I'm sure there's one Paul out there that is very happy about this. Oh, and they removed a bunch of the stuns, which is actually a good thing. But man, really? This is it? I guess they are more focused on the PvE game mode, but the PvE in Overwatch 1 is kinda really boring and it tastes like cat piss. I still think the king of PvE content has caught zombies since it has so much replay value. Overwatch 2's PvE looks more like Garden Ops from Garden Warfare, which is, uh, that, that, that's not a good thing, alright? I can't really comment on this aspect of Overwatch 2 though, since I haven't played it yet. I hope it is good, but after seeing the rabbit hole blizzard went down and how stagnant and annoying overwatch has become to play i don't have much faith honestly this is a seriously flawed game that gets annoying the more you play it i can't really talk from a competitive point of view but as a casual average joe this game is kind of infuriating i don't know man i might have triggered some hardcore overwatch fans with my baby rant so uh, please let me know what you think down below i'd love to hear what you guys have to say also subscribe J just do it you piece of shit
Spotty, Spotty, Spotty.